My name is Leslie Patterson and I'm a Scottish athlete but I live here in lovely San Diego. Um, I have been doing triathlon for about 15-16 uh, years. I started when I was a wee nipper snapper. Um, my first sport was actually rugby and I like to get dirty and I like stuff that was a challenge so when I gave that up I got into triathlon. My other career is also in film so I tend to do two things. I do a creative side and I have a, a sporting side. The thing that drives me is Innately, I love the sport. I love the way each three sports feels kinesthetically, um, and that pure challenge of pushing yourself to the edge. Because I think when you do that, you become vulnerable, and when you become vulnerable, you discover something new about yourself each time that happens. Um, so I like that kind of emotional and physical journey that I go on. My coach talks to me a lot about, you know, are you ready to win? Because I think a lot of athletes are. You know, do you get psyched out when you get close to it? Do you get nervous? Do you do you wig out? You know, do you really believe you can win? And uh, you know, I think as the years go on and, and I get more mature and I start proving myself in training and get some good race results, I'm getting closer and closer to that. When I'm going really well in a race, I'm not even thinking about that. I'm so much in the zone that the result is what the result is. So I think if I have a, have those kind of races without thinking too much about it, I'm gonna win. But I think if I focus too much on the win. I'm going to get too heady about it. So it's, it's a fine balance. It's like you care about it so much and it means so much about it, so much to you and you visualize it every time you're out training. And yet on race day, you kind of have to let it go and then not care about it. It's a really weird dichotomy. So when you're training in triathlon, you have essentially four sports. You have the swimming, biking, running, and gym work. So you're pretty much either training or, or, or running between training every day, all day it feels like. There is no real recovery, so if I don't wear compression, I'm screwed for the next day of training, because I'm always on my feet, I'm always running around. During training is, is, is one form of compression, and then as a recovery basis is the other form of compression. So if I didn't wear that, there's no way I could do back-to-back six-hour days or five-hour days or hard sessions when it comes towards the season. So next year, I am really looking forward to, to using all the products um, because they've worked like a dream this year and I feel like I've used a tenth of what CEP has to offer. So next year, I want to be you know, in the race suits and, and you know, wearing the tights and the shorts and, and, and kind of, you know, now I believe in it, uh, it's easier to uh, go full steam ahead and use all the products.